Well, farmers are turning to the same technology that drivers used to get from point A to point B. WFMZ's Bo Colt now shows us how GPS guidance is helping them stay a step ahead of Mother Nature. Bringing in the autumn harvest. For Copley Borough, Lehigh County farmer Joel Newhard, that means turning to the sky. Right now we are tracking 20 different satellites. Newhard uses GPS technology to farm his 300 fields, covering more than 2,500 acres. So when you say technology, GPS, how does that translate to farming? Creating a map of the yield. A color-coded map tells Newhard where the best yields are. So the more green you have, mm -hmm. the better the better the crop is. The satellite's receiver is fixed to the top of a farm machine. And just like a car, the satellite signals tells Newhart his location within a six inch accuracy. We also can use it then to steer the machine. So we're using uh, automatic guidance. This is a soybean field. So over the winter, Joe will analyze all the data that he's acquired with his GPS system. He'll study that. And then that way in the spring, he'll know which areas yield the best crop and which areas need to be better fertilized. This whole, I guess, iPhone generation is, 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 is hitting farmers too. Well, with the increased cost of seeds and fuel, all our inputs, you have to really manage those in order to have a, uh, a productive business. By cutting fuel, seed, and fertilizer costs, Newhart says the technology saves him up to $10,000 a year, but also says it takes two to three years to recoup the initial costs. You really see a lot of savings and a lot of benefit to it, so we're going to stick with it, and it's the, it's the wave of the future. So who knew state-of-the-art technology can now be found down on the farm? Bo Colt now, 69 News.